first female contender is Louise. And she's facing Lightning. Over to John Anderson. Contender! The final is underway. If Louise is first to the top and back again, she'll score 10. Should Lightning win, then Louise will be dropped on the line in an explosive flash. Lightning, first to the changeover. Unhitches, strikes the down button and hooks up for the return journey. Louise, the Preston Bridal Shop owner, not wedded to this event, her first time on the rope and her last. Lightning coming home for the impact, boots Louise off the tightrope and into the safety net. James Van, Sean Phillip, proud of Lightning for yet another faultless show. Once again, she's outperformed all around there. Louise well short of the finish. Lightning strike means she's out of the points and into the next. The second female contender is Jane. And she's facing Rebel. Over to John Anderson. Contender! Success on the high tension tightrope before, scored 10 in her heat, now climbing fast in this final. She's going to make the changeover platform marginally ahead of Rebel. And it's all in the dismount. And Jane unbuckles, turns on a sixpence, and she's going to be flying down that tightrope at breakneck speed. And poor old Rebel knows she's in for a face full of netting. Impact for Jane, plunge time for Rebel. James' dad, Julian, boyfriend Andy, more than content with that 10-point opening. Double-footed impression on the pad for Jane, deep depression for Rebel. Jane, what a fantastic start. You scored 10 points. Thank you. I'm the first team. I'm really enjoying this with all their games. I was a bit wary of Rebel, but thankfully I've pulled, picked up 10 points. I mean, yeah, you seem to fly that tightrope effortlessly. I mean, it's just... It's my big monkey arms, that's what it is. <laughs> big monkey arms. A great start. Rebel, I think you knew you were up against it there. No, I did. She may be a diver, but I know she's really good at the backstroke, so I'll give yeah. it to her. <laughs> well said. Let's give it up for Rebel and Jane. While Auntie Peggy and Cousin Joanne lead the cheers, let's review the scores. One event down, Louise remains on zero. Jane starts with ten. Our first male contender is Neil. And he's facing Diesel. Over to John Anderson. Contender Rene! Is the writing on the wall for Diesel? Well, it's certainly on the head of Neil's dad. Neil's first competition tightrope, and does it show? <laughs> The Lancashire Rugby League professional all over the shop. Can he make up the time when he unshackles his harness? Diesel will be first to unbuckle. Slow with his hardware. Neil's got one chance to steal this. Oh, blimey, he's blown it. Diesel on the return journey. He won't be derailed. Neil might as well throw himself into the net now. Diesel wins it. Neil's tightrope history. Brian and Matty bitterly disappointed with that. Dave Walters fans glad Neil got a stuffing. Let's not say stuffing in front of the bird. He came down like a, well, like a shot stag, really. I deserve to come down like that. It was useless, that one. Disappointed with that one? Yeah, a bit gutted. Well, but, uh, it? Plenty, of, plenty of games left. Exactly, it is the first game, and you've got lots of time to get some more points. Let's give it up for Neil and Diesel. Dave Walters fans in full voice, singing man-sized chickens and green-haired trombone players. It's more like an episode of The X-Files, this. The truth is out there. Our second male contender is Dave. And he's up against Ace. Over to John Anderson. Contender ready! ready! Three, two, one! In his heat, Dave was beaten on the tightrope by Ace. Dave, the chicken and chips fast food waiter from Exeter Way, needs to be quick if he's not to be basted and beaten on the tightrope once again. Dave's first to the platform. Simultaneous drop down. Who's going to get away first? Ace is one handed. Dave's away. It's going to be tight on the rope. Ace wins it. Not exactly hands down, but certainly feet up. Dave a moment away from 10 points. Neil's fans relieved to see that result and being shamelessly upstaged by the overacting Troy the Chicken.
It was Ace's amazing courage that won this, launched himself single-handed after the turnaround, and it was all the edge he needed to hit the cushion first. After one event, neither Neil nor Dave is off the mark.